good news. Somebody still has a job. Yeah. What are the expected consequences for economic growth and employment as a result of the green transition, which actually entails significant investments and widespread reskilling of workers? So let me start with a key fact. Green investments will need to double by 2030 to close to $5 trillion, with one third in clean electricity generation and 20% in network infrastructure. So $5 trillion of investments requirements for net zero until 2030, of which 1.6 trillion in clean electricity generation, $964 billion in infrastructure, $792 billion in buildings, $728 billion in transportation, and $518 billion in fuel production. This additional investment should add an extra extra 0.4 percentage point a year to annual global GDP growth, with global GDP 4% higher in 2030 than it would have been based on current trends. The major innovation efforts needed to bring new clean energy technologies could represent a major boost to productivity and create entirely new industries, in addition to generating major health benefits, with 2 million fewer premature deaths globally from air pollution in 2030 compared to today. The green transition should also create millions of jobs in clean energy, including energy efficiency, as well as in engineering, manufacturing and construction industries. For instance, clean energy alone could generate 14 million jobs by 2030. 